Data rights is all about extreme visceral combat. It's all about action, adrenaline. We have awesome violence. When we started working on Jack Slate at the initial concept stage, it was important to convey everything about his character and his abilities at a single glance. Jack Slate was an action hero and in many ways an action anti-hero, although his face conforms to heroic in his eyes and in his neutral face that suggests thinly shackled urges of violence and a feral nature that ties him to shadow. We took the obvious route and tried to make the characters photoreal, but when we started playing we kind of found that it backfired on us. It was just so visceral, it, it just made people uncomfortable playing, hitting these really kind of photorealistic characters and seeing them react to it. We didn't want to water down the, the violence and the action, so we took a different route and a different approach to the characters made them stylized and graphic and we just felt this, this worked so much better. In terms of the palettes used, we went for a palette that suggested subconsciously a police officer. So we used blues, greys, cold tones and lots of black and white. He wears colours of all clothes. With our character, gameplay is always the first consideration when it comes to designing them. And Jack's design almost completely stems from his fighting style. He, he fights like a boxer. He's all about power. There's, there's very little showiness. It's all about impact. The, the guy is basically a tank. So we have a very muscular, you know, hugely stacked design to reflect that. Jack and Shadow were definitely designed as a pair. They both share this wild, lupine look and their feral nature. Um, Shadow is quite literally... Jack's animalistic side. When it came to making Shadow, we had to be as practical as possible. He's an agile and powerful character, and we needed to make sure that the model would allow the animators to move him in such a way that this was clear. As part of that, we spent an awful lot of time developing a specially created fur shader, just for that extra touch of, of authenticity. Shadow looks like a real dog, he acts like a real dog, he, he feels as if he's that proper canine as opposed to some stupid AI buddy. Shadow shares a palette to Jack. He's in black and white because he's a wolf malamute, but also with lots of cold tones in his fur to link him to Jack visually. They both have these lupine, glowing, fierce animal eyes that indicate that they're ready for action at any point. They have physical similarities in that they're both built for speed in the hindquarters and, and in the upper body for raw explosions.